she texted me like this isn't going to work and i was like what's not going to work and she was just like us what that is so shitty but i still love her i still love her so much she never gave you the attention you deserved anyway I just don't understand why she would end it like this. I am so sorry. All the girls in here see why I have to fall in love with a straight girl. <laughs> Ouch. She's in her screenwriting class too. Not helping, Jimena. Sorry, sorry. Why is it so dark in here? Oh, this better. Shit. I'm sorry. What's wrong, Frank? Divya dumped me. What? Oh no. <laughs> Fuck it, I need a distraction. Layla, are you sure Maya is not bisexual but just leans more towards men? I'm like 99.9% .9 sure she's straight. So is spaghetti until it's wet. You got that from Tumblr. Yeah, I got my entire personality from Tumblr. Well, has she come out to you? As what? A straight. No one comes out as straight. Well, they should. She didn't specifically say that she's straight, but she has a boyfriend. I did a drone for all of high school. Yeah, I know, but... This is different. Maya gives off these aggressively hetero vibes as in religiously wears tube tops. Oh, so we're talking like straight straight. She's super into this dude too. God, he's ugly. She posted him on Instagram calling him her goofball. Oh. When a straight girl calls her boyfriend a goofball on Instagram, it means he's a homophobe who can't dress. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start commenting love is love on all of the pictures straight girls post of their ugly ass boyfriends. You got that from Tumblr too. Yeah. So Chris, her stupid boyfriend. Chris? He's named Chris? That is way too on the nose. Right? And I swear to God, he looks like a potato. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, most guys named Chris kind of look like potatoes. <laughs> or toes. Chris's face is the love child between a potato and a toe. <laughs> I can't with you. I'm gonna be stuck in class looking at her beautiful face and potty and hair. Okay, and okay. But if she is happily coupled with Potato Man, then it is time to move on. But how? I really, really like her. Oh, unrequited love. I feel so stupid crying for a girl who probably hasn't cried for me at all. It's okay, it's in your theater kid nature to be melodramatic. I just don't know how I'm gonna get over Maya when I'm gonna be stuck in class with her. Well, everyone knows that the best way to get over a straight girl is to get under a dyke. So... Tears back, she clones, flex my gun show, mirror talk. So I know I'm 24 karat gold Every boy wish they were me I got every girl on the count of three Magnetic I can't help it All right, let's find you both rebound strap appointments Are we really just here for that? You're just making any excuse you can to see that hottie Aria you've been in love with all year Okay, I am not in love with her Whatever you have to tell yourself we are not here to see the girl who I am not in love with. We are here to find you both dates. Besides, Arya gets off her shift in like three minutes, so we won't even catch her. So you memorized her work schedule? As friends. What? I platonically memorized her work schedule. You do realize if you were a guy doing that, it'd be merit to call you a creepy stalker. I'm sorry. You're the one who was so scared to just go into Home Depot and talk to girls that you bought binoculars and dragged us all the way onto the roof so we could peep at girls like creepy stalkers. You're both acting like straight men. Both of you just go down there and talk to whoever girls you want. Just cut the stalker shit. Fine. Him and I'll make a deal with you. I'll go on a date with a random lesbian this week if you just ask Arya out. Only if you stop obsessing over Maya. Fine. Deal. Ugh, but do you think Arya likes likes me? Oh my god, you're so annoying. Yes, she like likes you. But are we sure she even likes girls? She wears a Haley Kyoko shirt like three days out of each week. She likes girls. Ugh, all right. Oh, ooh, Layla, look at her. What about her? I don't know, she seems a little too hard butch for me. What kind of butch are you looking for? Not so butch that they'll pull out a whole toolkit and fix your whole porch. Oh, look at her. 
What about her? She looks like the type to want to settle down in a cottage with her fairy girlfriend. Not my type. Okay, well, how about- Helena, I got this. Go call Aria. What, just like pick up the phone and call her? Yes, girl, call her. I don't know if I could do that. Oh my God, I'll dial for you. No! I can't do this, I'm sorry. I just, I can't do this. Oh, come on. I'm just, I actually um, have a lot of homework that I have to do, so I'm going to head back to my dorm and go do that. Really? You're just gonna leave us here? I am so sorry. I am just too much of a nervous dyke to do this. I'm, I'm just gonna go, I'm sorry, I, I'm going. Dolled up? Oh, yeah, um... <laughs> <laughs> What's the special occasion? Nothing, I was just, uh, hardware shopping. Cool. Cool, well, it was nice to see you. Um, actually, I wanted to tell you something. Okay, sure. Um, so, I like your shirt. <laughs> this shirt? Oh, no, no, not that one. I mean, it, it's a nice shirt, it, it's not an ugly shirt. But, um, I was talking about the Haley Kyoko shirt. Oh. Thanks. Yeah, I see you've been wearing it a lot. Uh-huh. Um, see, usually girls who frequently adorn themselves uh, with the image of singer Haley Kiyoko, they have certain traits in common. And what traits are those? Well, you know. <laughs> a shared love of beautifully crafted music videos? An enjoyment of pink and yellow hair dye? Well, yes, yeah, that <laughs> and... <laughs> I'm, I'm guessing you're asking me if I like girls. Um, yeah, I mean, no pressure, but if you are the type who, you know, listens to Girl in Red. I'm bisexual. Oh, that is great. And I'm a lesbian. Look at that. Two ladies who like ladies. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um, I actually live with my girlfriend. Um, she's around here, actually. She was just getting me something to drink. Yeah. Hi. Hey, babe. Mm. Got your coffee. Thank you. Is there oat milk in it? Of course. Can never forget the oat milk. Thank you so much. Mm. Mm. Oh, hi. Uh, babe, who's this? Sorry. Ava, this is Jimena. She's in my gen ed class. Jimena, meet Ava. Hi. Um, so you're Aria's girlfriend. Yeah, what's with the outfit? Oh, um, Hardware was... shopping. <laughs> so, Ava, you're not like Aria's friend, girlfriend. Like, oh, me and my girlfriend, gal pals. Like, we have a cat together. <laughs> wow, a cat. So, so you two are together, together. <laughs> Uh-huh. Yeah. Yeah, Aria and I have been together for the past two years. Yeah, oh. tomorrow is actually our two-year anniversary. That is so cool. That's so cool. <laughs> so what was it you wanted to ask me? Um, uh, nothing, nothing actually. Um, I was just inquiring about your choice of garment and seeing if I had spotted yet another member of our LGBTQ plus community. I am a member of our LGBTQ plus community. Yeah, I haven't been dating a straight girl for the past few years. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah, that, that makes sense, yeah. Yeah, um, why are you asking? Um, no reason. I was um, just looking for more queer-owned businesses to support. So now that I know you're queer, I know where to get my uh, hardware and appliances and... <laughs> I work at Home Depot. Right, yeah. Um, I was just kidding. I meant to support the queer employee at the Home Depot. What exactly is it that you want? Yeah, is there anything else you wanted to talk about? No, no. Okay, no. great. Um, you two have a great anniversary tomorrow. Sure, Jimena. Yeah, we will. Okay, so... Bye, Jimena. Bye. Fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Oh my god. I ran into Aria with her girlfriend who she has a cat with. Oh no. Oh man, I am so <sighs> sorry. So wait, Aria has a girlfriend? Ugh, I just want to watch The L Word and forget about it. I really don't want to talk about this. 
And Ava was being so rude, like just rubbing it in my face. Oh, I'm prettier than you and Ari loves me, not you. And you're just an ugly little dyke who will die alone. You won't die alone. You can't promise that. If worse comes to worse and we're both unmarried by 35, we can marry each other for tax purposes. Ugh, maybe I should just give up and buy some cats. Cats? Plural? Yeah, like so many cats. <laughs> I can't stop thinking about how pathetic I am. Falling for a straight girl is a phase you go through when you're a baby gay in middle school. Not when you're in fucking college. I should be over this shit. Hey, you are not pathetic. I am. I am pathetic. No, you are not. You are an amazing friend and screenwriter and lesbian earring icon and weird eyeliner fashion icon and cinematographer. Cinematographer. For the last time, it is pronounced cinematographer. Do not interrupt me. No, seriously, how can you be in film school and still not pronounce cinematography? And you also have amazing eyes and hair and a beautiful face. Okay, okay, thank you, I get it. But if I'm all of those things, then why don't the pretty girls like me? Like, I'm good girlfriend material, right? Yeah, 100%. Frankie, hello. What? We're validating that Layla is good girlfriend material. Were you not paying attention? What, what were you doing? Nothing. All right, then let us see your phone. No. <laughs> Oh my god. They were so social media stalking Divya. I was not. Yes, you were. Oh my god, did they post something about the breakup? Don't encourage them, Jimena. Unfollow Divya right now. <sighs> Fine. You know, everyone says I'm so lucky that I'm bi because I have so many options, but more options just means more people to break my heart. Fuck love. Maybe we just weren't meant to find it. Maybe we should all take a break from trying to find the one. Hmm. I mean, I have dreams, you know? Yeah, and I've kind of always wanted to go through a hoe phase. Maybe now's the time to start. I say we focus on breaking into the film industry and stop letting these girls distract us. Girls are going to be practically flinging themselves at us when we're running Hollywood anyway. I say this demands a toast. What? <laughs> Fancy. <laughs> Let's make a pack. We are not gonna fall in love for the rest of the semester. Fuck that. We're not gonna fall in love for the rest of the school year. All right, we're not gonna fall in love for the rest of the school year. Not only that, but we're gonna be badass bitches in film and outdo all the Tarantino bros in class. God, I hate Tarantino bros. Cinematography bros mm. are the worst too. The worst. Like, oh my God, we get it. You have no creativity, so you've based your entire personality around the fact that you have a $5 million camera that can zoom in on a mosquito's butt crack. <laughs> I'm in. All right. Repeat after me. I will not fall in love for the rest of the school year. I will not fall in love for the rest of the school year. I will not do dumb gay shit. I will, I will not, not do dumb, dumb gay shit. I will instead focus on being a successful bitch and outdoing all the Tarantino bros. I will instead focus on being a successful bitch and outdoing all the Tarantino bros. Cheers. Hey. <laughs> Well, it's getting pretty late. I have a lot of homework to catch up on. I should probably head back to my don't dorm. Don't be boring. Stay a little longer. Yeah, come on, stay. Fine, but if I fail my exam, it's your fault. I can live with that. <laughs> oh, I have an idea. Let's play Truth or Dare. Truth or Dare? What are you, 12? You're no fun. Jimena, Truth or Dare? Fine, Dare. Or Truth. I'll do Truth. Okay. Who is the sexiest person in this room? The hottest person in this room is hands down Layla. Not even a competition. What? Thank you. Okay, ouch. <laughs> okay, it's my turn. Okay, Layla, truth or dare? Dare. Okay, good choice. Um, let's see, I dare you Make it to... something good though. Fine. I dare you to kiss Jimena. Okay, cool. And then I can say I kiss my best friend. Jimena, get over here. What? Are you nervous? No. Me? No. No. Okay, just making sure. Okay, um, that's cool. Um, Frankie, it's your turn. Yeah. Truth or dare? Maybe we should just call it a night. Yeah, that sounds like a pretty good idea. What? No, come on! Stay! Let's stay a little longer. Come on, we can keep playing. <laughs> well, I think I'm gonna head back. I have some homework to catch up on. All right. Layla, I know you're in there. Can you let me in? Oh shit, it's Maya. What? what? How does she know you're even in here? I don't know. Layla, 
Caleb, my roommate saw you walking into Jimenez's dorm. I know you're in there. What do you want? We need to talk. About what? Just let me in. What is so important that you need to barge in here when I'm clearly with my friends? What do you have to say to me? I think the real question is what do you have to say to me? Excuse me? You really need to stop subtweeting and just say what you want to say to people's faces. Are you stalking my Twitter? This morning you tweeted and I quote, There's this girl in my class who I want to step on me. Problem is she's dating this ugly ass man named Chris, which is the worst name in the English language. Okay, yeah, so I may have confessed some things to Twitter I shouldn't have, and I'm sorry I called Chris ugly. Oh, he is. Was. Wait, it is. He's, he's alive. He's just not my boyfriend anymore. Oh, uh, sorry to hear that. No, you're not. Yeah, I'm not. For the record, I agree. Chris is one of the worst names in the English language. Maya, I'm so sorry that I tweeted that. I was just so sad. It, it's fine. Just curious, though. What makes you think I'm straight? Well, for starters, you're wearing a shoulderless tube top. Practically everything you wear is a shoulderless top. So many shoulderless tops. Well, if it's of any interest to you, I don't like to label myself. But if I had to put a label on my sexuality, I'm pansexual. Oh, that's, that's cool. I didn't know that. You give off very aggressively heterosexual energy. Yeah, I get that a lot. Look, Maya, I really, really like you, and I'm sorry I confessed my feelings to Twitter instead of to you. I was just so convinced that you were straight. It's okay. I get it. Thank you for being honest with me. Really? You're not mad? How would you like to go get ice cream with me tonight? <clears throat> There's a shop that's no, 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 open no, no. a couple blocks Wait, away. Wait, what about our pact? Pact? Yeah, actually, um, so we just made a pact. Pardon my annoying friend here. Yes, but I would love to get ice cream with you. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm going to stop Layla from breaking her pack. No, you're not going to sabotage your best friend just because you don't like that she's... Gone. Divya? Yeah. 